Hi guys, I'm Soumya and once again welcome back to my channel Dash of Delight. Today I'm going to be sharing how to make kidney beans curry or rajma masala. So let's get started and check out the recipe. For this I have taken 2 cups of red kidney beans and soaked them overnight. So you can also soak them for 6 to 7 hours or uh, if you are running short of time you can also soak them in hot water for 2 to 3 hours. That will also do the job but guys overnight soaking is the best. So just wash it twice under running water and then soak it in a bowl full of water. Now let's start cooking them. So first of all we need to boil these beans. So here I have taken a pressure cooker. Now I am adding 2 glasses of water like this. And now I am going to add some salt, so 1 teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of garam masala powder. So if you want you can take whole garam masala also but uh, the powdered form is absorbed best by the beans so that's why I am using it. Now place the lid and let it cook for around 3 whistles. Now meanwhile let's start with the preparation of our gravy. So in a pan take 3 tablespoons of oil and once it is heated add 1 teaspoon of cumin seeds. Once they start changing the color add grated ginger and garlic. You may also take ginger garlic paste. Now add finely chopped onions. Saute the onions till it changes the color to golden brown. This process will take around 4 to 5 minutes. So keep sauteing them. So see guys, it has changed the color to golden brown and now at this point start adding the dry spices. So here comes the turmeric powder, then coriander powder, then comes the red chili powder. So guys, you can adjust the quantity of red chili powder as per your taste. Then add the garam masala powder and rajma masala. Now mix everything well. Now add tomatoes here. So I have coarsely blended my tomatoes like this. Add in the tomatoes and mix it well. Now just to ensure that our masala doesn't burn quickly, add a dash of water, around half a cup and then mix it well. Now keep cooking this masala for around 3 to 4 minutes guys. So see our masala has started thickening. So it is done now. Now let's check our beans. So it has been boiled nicely. So let's check it once. See. How nicely it has boiled can you see so guys now add these beans into the masala add in all the beans remember do not discard the water in which we boil the beans we are going to use that bean stock later on in our gravy so now start mixing everything together we need to nicely coat all the kidney beans into the masala like this also remember guys at this stage the heat should be at medium to high temperature saute it continuously for a minute or two and now add in the bean stock so this is the same water in which we boil the kidney beans. So please guys do not discard this water as it gives amazing flavor as well as color to the curry. Now mix it once, lower down the temperature to low medium, place the lid and let it cook for around 2 minutes. So guys it's been 2 minutes. Now open the lid and see how nicely our curry is bubbling. So just give it a good mix. While cooking our beans have settled down at the bottom. So just give it a good mix like this. And now guys our curry is all done. So just add in a pinch of garam masala powder around 1 third teaspoon. And then at this stage also add in the chopped coriander leaves. Now give everything a good final mix like this. And now guys this amazing curry is all ready to be served. So just grab a bowl and take it out. Can you see the texture and the gorgeous maroonish brown color guys? This kidney beans curry really tastes amazing. Now garnish it with some onion, lemon wedge and some coriander leaves. Kidney beans curry makes super combo with some steamed rice or even with naan, roti etc. Do squeeze this lemon before you have it and enjoy. So guys if you like my recipe please hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. We'll be right back soon. Bye bye.